Hey guys, in today's video, we're going to be looking at how to change the cutting point of an object or shape within TrueCut RD Works. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, back in the program here. Now, uh, yeah, when it comes to the cutting point, this is obviously the point that uh, it will start cutting your shape with or by. So when you're setting up the cutting order and so forth, you can also set the cutting point. So as we can see over here, a process NO will be 62 because I've got a lot of shapes in my design. But uh, yeah, if you have set up your cutting order and that, then you can also set up a cutting point. So let's say we've got um, uh, multiple shapes I select these two move them to the left I'm sure what happens there uh, but in any case so now let's say you're cutting a first and then b and then uh, so what you can do is you can decide if you want a to start perhaps in this corner cut right around and then start in that corner then obviously if you set your direction it will also um, change so you can speed up so instead of having it start at this corner cut around move your blade start at that corner cut around you can try save some space by making your um, cutting points closer so now in order to do that what we want to do is we want to go to our edit menu on the top um, main menu then we go down and we find um, set cut point now once you have activated this it will notice that um it's hard to select things you can't drag and drop so now what you want to do is you want to select the shape you want to set your cutting point to but you have to precisely click on that line otherwise um it's got quite a small threshold to miss now if i go on here let's just try get this one again i'm not currently missing there we go but if you zoom in it might be a bit easier but as you can see we've got a little x over there so that is where this cutting point is at the moment so what I can do is, let's say I go to this point, then what I want to do is double click this um, node over here in the top corner of this point. And now that is the new cutting point for this one. So we click on this side, if I can get it right, there we go. And now we can see that one is right next to it. So we've got both these cutting points um, right by each other, which uh, will speed up our process at least a bit. But yeah, that is it on setting up or changing the cutting point. Then uh, once you are done, you can simply just press escape. Otherwise, uh, you might get quite frustrated because you cannot select other things. So just press escape and then you'll see you are out of it. But yeah, otherwise, if we head here to softwaretraining.co.za, you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover. And also you can isolate your search on the top right. If you do not, however, find the videos you're looking for, just simply go here request a training video fill in the mini form and then we'll do our best to try and make that for you but otherwise thanks guys for watching and cheers